Hello and welcome to Kindred Spirit Tarot. This is your daily message for all zodiac signs for Monday the 20th of May 2019. Thank you so much for joining me. If it's your first visit, welcome. If you are returning, then welcome back and thank you. For today's reading, I am using the Druid Craft Tarot deck by Philip and Stephanie Cargon. Okay, let's see what the start of the week has in store for us. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. What is the message? Wow. Okay. Thank you. As quick as that, my friends. We have the Eight of Pentacles, followed by the Five of Wands in the reverse. This is wonderful to see. And followed by the Ten of Pentacles back again. Lots of um, pentacle energy um, over the weekend and, and spilling into the start of the week also. Wow. Your first card is the Eight of Pentacles. Eight, the number of abundance, the number of harvest, of manifestation. Here I see you diligently working away. Um, you've been crafting out your pentacles here. Um, you've put the effort in. You have put the hard work in. You have put all the research in. You have put all the love and <sighs> labour into your creation. And the result of that is you um, manifesting um, abundance uh, into your life my friends this is um i'm drawn to um, almost the colors here i'm feeling his his little blue cap here um he's been loyal to his trade he's been loyal to his craft he has followed his heart and he has acted in the physical wholeheartedly and now he is manifesting abundance because he's believed in himself. He has believed in what he was doing. He has believed in what he is creating. Wow. And next you get the five of wands in the reverse. Five normally, oh, sorry, five is the number of crisis, chaos, it's also the number of challenges and change. And there is a change because it's in the reverse. So I'm feeling for those of you that were going through a, a struggle, a crisis, a conflict, a disagreement, a challenge of sorts, um, there is a change and the change is um, this is reversed now. You are over the struggle. You are, I'm really drawn to the rooster when I look at this illustration because the rooster here, he, he banishes um, the darkness, the underworld, if you like, um, the low vibrations, that low frequency that we talked about over the weekend. The, um, your, this is gone now, this lower frequency, lower vibration, something that was... Um, causing you um, some bother, was bothersome, um, it's gone, it's been banished. This is a new day. A new day is dawning, my friends. And next we have the Ten of Pentacles. Ten, a culmination, an ending and a beginning. And again, we here you are with, with pentacles all around you, um, even hanging them on the wall because you have been um again this is you you've been diligent you've worked hard you've you've put all of the the effort in you've been confident you've been courageous you have been brave 
and the result is domestic bliss everything in the physical um, being balanced being harmonious this is um, domestic uh, fulfillment as we look here we can see this uh, the family and the family dog even the dogs really happy so I'm feeling this is happy times real happy joyful times this is contentment wow okay we are starting the week feeling really contented we are over struggle we are over conflict and chaos and crisis uh, we are busy now manifesting for ourselves the dream life that we envision us living wow <laughs> i'm loving this five of wands in the reverse my friends this is absolutely wonderful okay who is calling me it's actually the colors <clears throat> the secret language of color by inner cigar what is the message for my wonderful friends from spirit for Monday the 20th of May 2019 thank you Ooh, stuck to my finger I'll just lower up that camera there we go okay wow bronze strengthen your body one and four one and four adding up to five so i feel you have um a, a new found inner strength um coming through my friends um that is allowing you to step back from these low vibration um uh, energies uh, frequencies that are have been directed at you um, for over the weekend we started flying high higher than these lower vibration frequencies we're not joining the low vibrations we're saying to them if you want want to be around me then you have to come up to where I am because I'm not coming down to to you uh, and I feel now that you have uh, got some real great inner strength coming <laughs> oh brilliant okay bronze inspires strength wisdom and love helping you to get promotions and bringing wealth into your life and attracting the right people into your business that's why this is coming the reverse bronze also aids in successful negotiations teaching people to trust their instincts use bronze to break destructive emotional patterns release irrational fears and anxieties and flush toxic thoughts and feelings out of your body allow the bronze ray to bring strength and vitality back to your body Focus on any part of your body that needs to be strengthened and place your hands on this part of your body. Breathe into it and visualise a bronze thread coiling around that part of your body, stitching it together and strengthening it. Say, Divine Spirit, surround me with the bronze ray of light which will heal, strengthen and rejuvenate my body wow using bronze helping you to manifest <laughs> what you desire into your life this is wonderful my friends absolutely wonderful manifesting wealth okay now who is calling me it is the wisdom of avalon colette baron reed is the message for my wonderful friends from spirit for monday the 20th of may thank you and so you have 
the lady of the lake number eight <laughs> another number eight absolute truth courage self-respect and responsibility okay <clears throat> The Lady of the Lake represents the highest order of respect for yourself and the manner in which you operate within the world around you. She is the harsher element of truth where denial is swept away by a tidal wave of events. In the ancient legend of Avalon, the Lady of the Lake presented Merlin with the Sword of Truth, which had been claimed by Arthur who became High King of Britain. The magic that welded this metal was fired by the will of the God Goddess. Consequently, when the Lady of the Lake appears, she demands nothing short of total truth and integrity, and she asks you to be mindful of all the signs, signals and omens that present themselves to you. This is not the time to second guess. If a signal appears, be assured that a challenge has been presented. Moving forward without acknowledgement of the challenge will result in unnecessary difficulties. If the signal is to move, she pushes you to act. Do so, for a victory is imminent. Regardless of your question, the message is to take care when the Lady of the Lake appears. A serious business is at stake. The lady reminds you of your personal responsibility in shaping your reality and its consequences. Seek the sword of truth within yourself and great success will be yours. Have courage for when the lady appears, the strength of Avalon is behind you in support of your quest for wholeness and abundance so she is reminding you always be in your truth no lies no deceit not even little white lies i am hearing um being in your truth having the integrity to walk the path of truth that high flying path again my friends high frequency wow oh wow okay Oracle of the Unicorns, Cordelia Francesca Brabs, <clears throat> whom I lovingly call my trusty steeds. Ooh, okay. <clears throat> oh, they've given you two. We don't mind. <laughs> okay. We have, oh, courage. You are safe. Fear is an illusion. Set yourself strong, healthy boundaries, my friends. Um, learning to say no is a big thing, especially for empaths. Um, because we are always considering other people, even people that um, don't have good intentions towards us, we still find it hard to... Um, be disingenuous back because we're still considering their feelings so setting yourself strong boundaries learning to say no i am hearing oh yes and be loved and be love beloved prepare for your life partner romance is returning to your relationship believing you are lovable uh, it's again um high flying frequency is love it's the highest frequency, the love frequency. Um, you're being reminded to stay in love, be love, show love, give love, have the courage to be love in every action um, and in every thought I am hearing. Oh, this is an absolutely beautiful message, my friends. Some of you are now really I'm feeling attracting uh, manifesting uh, abundance and wealth into your lives this is absolutely fantastic <laughs> well thank you for all of your likes your shares 
Welcome new subscribers, thank you so much for your support. You have joined a wonderful family of kindred spirits. And thank you too for your warm, kind, encouraging comments. I really enjoy receiving them, so do keep them coming. And so may favour be with you all, as I wish you a joyful, a peaceful and a truly blessed day. And until tomorrow, my friends, goodbye.